And the Dalai Lama is currently in Ladakh in Leh for a month, which is likely to raise a red flag in China and it sends a strong message of India's resolve. The Dalai Lama today said that India and China will have to solve the border issues through talks that military conflict won't benefit anyone, a day after he stressed that Tibet must get meaningful autonomy. A human chain, 10 kilometers long as thousands gathered on the streets of Leh to welcome the Dalai Lama. It's the first visit of the Tibetan spiritual leader since Ladakh was carved out as a separate union territory in August 2019. The big question, how the Dalai Lama's visit will go down with China amid a prolonged standoff between PLA and Indian Army along the line of actual control in eastern Ladakh. Not surprisingly, the Dalai Lama had a message for peace for the two countries and extended an olive branch to China, who had objected to the Prime Minister's birthday greetings to the Tibetan leader last week, calling it interference in its internal affairs. Basically, India and China most cooperated to nations and neighbor. Sooner or later, you have to solve this problem through talk through peaceful means. Some Chinese hardliner, they consider me splitist and reactionary. So always criticize me. Uh, but now more and more Chinese now realize the uh, Lama not seeking independence. Dalai Lama will be staying in Ladakh for next one month and China will be closely watching it. This is Dalai Lama's first visit after Ladakh was carved out as a union territory in August 2019. The visit also comes just two days before next round of military talks between India and China. The question is, will this further complicate matters? In Srinagar, Nazir Masoodi, finally.